Can we beat floors 5 through 7 today with this overpowered bunny team? Well, in this video we're about to find out. And that begins in... 3, 2, 1... Welcome back to Bean Gaming. A lot has happened over the past 12 hours. And let me just share you one by one here what's going on with my overpowered bunny team. So hang on, wait a minute, there's a rat god in there. He's not a bunny. All right, yeah, okay, that's fair enough. But let's go to our backpack, and I apologize because I guess I didn't showcase or show the stats for Bunny Tron yesterday. And if we take a look at him, he does boost Easter bunnies up to 20%. His range is 25, and your bunnies do have to be in range. So he's kind of like a demon mage, but only for bunnies. And I did open one of my Bunny Tron urns yesterday, so I had three left over, but when I went to play today, the three urns were gone. So I don't have any more Bunny Tron mythics, I guess, and I, I don't know. We'll see if I can get those back somehow. But when you do, or if you do, get five Bunny Trons total, you want to apply four of them to the boost. That'd be a really good booster for your bunnies. And let's look at this one by one. So yesterday in my video, I showed Whiplash Bunny, and I was able to get greed on him. But I opened up another Whiplash Bunny urn, and I got a shiny. So I was like, all right, well, let me see if I can get Infernal or Oblivion on him or whatever the case is. And I'm not even kidding you, within five rolls, I got greed. And I was like, yes, let's go. That was completely awesome. And so now I did apply all of the additional Whiplash Bunnies to range. And look at this, his range starts at 20 and goes all the way to almost 40, which is crazy because he does full AoE damage in the range. So that is really cool, especially with Greed on him because he's a starter. Look at that, $300. And let's take a look at Bunny Basher. Bunny Basher is my favorite bunny of all of them. So look, uh, you're going to see in the game here. His range, I applied the four additional Bunny Bashers that I had to range, and he's almost at 70 for full AOE. Like, come on, are you kidding me? That's crazy. And then I did mention about Bunny Tron, that his urns disappeared. You want to apply those to boost if you get additional ones. And then Rat God. Why Rat God? Why would I put him on a bunny team? Well, he boosts. And that's the reason why he boosts creatures, holy and creatures. So I want to apply that additional boost to these bunnies over here. And then of course we have to include Demon Mage because Demon Mage is going to give us that 72% boost. So let's stop messing around here. Let's hop on in game and see if we can beat floors four, five, no, I'm sorry, floors five, six, and seven. Here we go. If you remember from yesterday's video, I was not able to defeat floor five, room one, the webbed widow, because I just couldn't, Whiplash Bunny just couldn't sustain that initial wave of spiders. And this was even difficult when it first came out. So I was only able to beat it one time yesterday, and that was before I ended up getting Shiny Whiplash Bunny with Greed on him. So we're going to see now, and also with the additional range boost. So we're going to see now if this loadout is going to be able to sustain and help. So I'm going to put one Whiplash here just to get money. I'll put another here, and then I'm going to put three right here. That's the nice thing about Whiplash Bunny is that he's only $300 and he's very cheap to upgrade. So we're going to see, we're going to see if I can sustain here. Come on, whip, 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 get him. And can I fully max? Let's fully max. Get, okay. One's fully maxed two. And there we go. Look at that. We're taking a little, no, we didn't even take any damage. That's great. That is wonderful. That's amazing. I like that a lot. Look at this. Now, Whiplash Bunny, I didn't take any damage. And are you ready for this, everyone? Infernal. Infernal Bunny Basher. Check this out. If I click on him, look at that. He covers li literally like the whole room. Bam. Knock out all those evil spiders. Isn't that awesome? <laughs> like, look at that range. Are you kidding me? His range right out of the gate is 54.6. No way he does that at only 10,000. Now, he's not the best AoE, but he's crazy insane for, look at that, that 54 range and Infernal. Now, Nightmare is the only one that would be better. You technically could get Greed on him if you wanted to, but look at this. And look at his pajamas. He's kind of sleepy. 
but he doesn't like spiders, so he is going to completely annihilate them. And we'll put a bunny basher right here. Let's take a look at his stats. First placement is $2,000, then $4,000, $6,000, $8,000, and 10000 That's quite a bit for only upgrading a certain character type or hero type. And we'll go ahead and put down our demon mage, that way he can boost... And I just, I don't know. Look at this. <laughs> this range just kills me every time. Okay, so upgrade is 20,000, then 35,000. We're already at a range of 60. I wish I could zoom out so you could see the, the range on this thing. I mean, you can just look right here. Look at this. Completely crazy, don't you think? And Infernal, one more upgrade. It's going to go from 6,000 to 20,000. Come on, one more bash, one more bash. Get him. There we go. And then for our upgrade four to five, he's gonna do 46,000 every four seconds. That's why this bunny basher is my absolute favorite hero of all of these bunnies. And that gigantic anvil hammer, his final upgrade is 120, so there we go. Look at this. And check him out, he's doing 46,000 now. And I'm gonna put down a rat god in just a moment. Let me see if I can upgrade these, the rest of these bunny bashers here. We're gonna fast forward the video so we can kind of speed things up here. We just turned to wave 14. Everyone's max. Look at bunny basher. He almost has a range of 70. That is completely insane. And his damage is 71,000 every four seconds. So that's just, I mean, it's not, there's better AOE heroes overall. I mean, you can't go wrong with shiny King Midas. I mean, no one's gonna beat that. But the range is 70, and there's six placements. And the, watch our boss. Watch our boss here. He's, let me see if I can zoom in before he even died. And okay, I couldn't even get into him really quick. We're going to go and play floor six next. Floor six. And should we do room one? Maybe we should try room five. Let's, let's try room five just for the heck of it. Should I leave the level up? Let's leave a difficulty level 13. We'll try it out. Let's see what happens. Just as a heads up, I know that I can beat room one on this floor, so that's not even an issue at all. But this is this is just super crazy. If I can, <laughs> I'm just trying to get off right out of the gates here really quick. And this would be crazy if I can win this this map with this team, because the bunny team it's good. It's just not crazy like my frank i love my frank team frank team is the absolute best in my opinion for me at least i mean there i know holy and paranormal those are the those are probably the best teams but I'm, I'm just saying for my personal preference i really really like those other teams and look at the, look at bunny basher come on bunny basher look at <laughs> Okay, that's just silly, isn't it? That's silly range right here, and he's only on level 3. Come on, I should put a bunny basher right up here just because, you know what I mean? Let's see, look at this. Bunny basher, he's bashing him. I have to be careful in the back to make sure that I have enough heroes in the back to cover. And I will. I'll put. I'll probably put rat gods in the back. Because I want the stars of the show to be the bunny b -b -b bashers. That's exactly right. Look at this. Man, he's just collecting the money like nothing. These mad scientists, you don't even stand a chance. All right, now we're fully maxed out. Look at this, range of 70. <laughs> oh, wow. Range of 70, I gotta keep my eye back here. I should upgrade, upgrade. And look at this, He, this bunny basher covers everything in range there. Okay, let's put another bunny basher here. That way we can symmetrically even things out. And he'll help out. I'll put a... Let me see, can he reach there? I'll put a Bunny Tron here. And he maxes out at 20, at a, at a maximum boost of 20. So we need to get some more urns to get that range going there. And these little crawlers don't stand a chance. Let's put this bunny back here, this bunny basher, so he can cover. And I wonder if... Okay... Nope, let's, let's finish putting these bunny bashers on this side here, this side here. Am I out of range? Oh, no, I am out of range. I don't even think this one's reaching. All right, let's fix that before it gets too late. This bunny basher, see, this one's not even reaching. All right, I'm going to have to get rid of him because I want them to be in the range. There we go. That's better. 
that's a better placement and I have two more left to place all right let's put one here and then one here I like that we can fully max these out so no issues there and then we'll put a rat god we'll put some rat gods in the back just because you're not the star of the show but we do want your boost so we're, we're really using you this time rat god we're only really using you look at this range though it's a range of 70 are you kidding me whiplash bunnies i should probably put them up there no it doesn't yeah it doesn't matter let's see little crawlers only forty-eight thousand. So what's what these what are these bunny bashers doing? Forty one thousand, and then I'm gonna place a demon mage. We'll place the demon mage right here. Does he reach? He doesn't reach those two. Okay, we're gonna sell. So we'll put the demon mage. This is kind of an awkward spot here. Okay, well at least he reaches those. These two bunny bashers, and now there's the seventy one thousand that we need. The mutant monolith. You don't stand a chance. We have the rat god. Oh, rat god. Eighty one range. That's really cool. Let's fast forward to the end of this video. We made it to wave 14. There's no issues going on here. We have our rat gods in the back. And we have these bunny bashers with this insane range of 70. Completely just engulfing all of these enemies. And I think it's only a mid tower. But I mean, it's he's my favorite. I'm just going to leave it at that. He is my absolute favorite of all the bunnies. And he's going to do the most damage, I think, out of all the bunnies just because of his range. And now we have the experiment at 800,000 health. And is he even going to be an issue? No, no issues at all. Just get him, Bunny Bash here. Get him. And we have these enemies coming down, the, the experiments all over the place. I'm not even concerned about that. We have our rat gods in the back that are going to help out. But these Bunny Bash here is just going to completely annihilate them. So now let's, let's get a close-up of toxic bunny there he is and he has a 5.6 million health and he's not going to be an overall issue because of our rat gods in the back but he's going to take some time because like i said bunny basher it's a great mid tower it's not anything overpowered so if we had our king midas right here this game would have been over with already but that's okay they you know without the rat gods i still think that toxic bunny would fall to our bunny bashers just because of the range but yeah look at this no issue at all and he doesn't even stun or destroy any of my heroes so toxic bunny thanks for playing do we get the toxic urn we don't let's go on to the next floor floor seven all right what do you think i should do so i'm on floor seven here i know i can beat room one and should we try room five i'll tell you what Let's do room one right away, and then we'll hop on into room five and see what actually happens here. Should I stay at level, difficulty level 30? I'm kind of scared about that one. Oh boy, let's leave it. Let's just play and see what happens. We're going to start the game. We're going to put two whiplash bunnies in the front, and then we'll put some more in the back just so I can get some money. Here we go. Here we go. If I can upgrade all of these whiplash bunnies here then I might stand a chance. I might stand a fighting chance here. Can we get them? Can we get them? Can we get them? Oh, this might have been more than I could bite off. But they're only 20. Look at this. I have 20 left. I have 20 left. This could potentially work. This could potentially work if I get down a bunny basher. Does the bunny basher work? Does he get him? He does! Yes! All right. Oh, wow. Here we go. And I'm going to sell these because I want to put them towards the front because they're going to earn me money because they have greed on them. There we go. Things are looking better. And he covers the entire floor. I should say he covers the entire room. I absolutely love it. And even even our whiplash bunnies. I mean, look at this. It has a he has a range of 39, which is absolutely crazy in and of itself. And these bunny bashers, did I tell you how much I enjoy these bunny bashers? They're really good. I'm less than $100 away, well, $170 away, $60 away from upgrading. Come on, give me that money. There we go, fully maxed out. Range of 69.16, so essentially 70. Smash, smash, upgrade. There he is. I can put down one more whiplash bunny let's put him yeah he'll be able to reach so we'll put him right here max him out look at this he co <laughs> he covers so much all right stop messing around here let's get the rest of these bunny bashers down 
just so we can stop messing around with this and get right down to business. Let's do an overview. That way you can see. Check him out. These minotaurs, no contest once I max out my bunny bashers. No contest at all. See ya. Goodbye. Complete floor wiped out. Let's get down our... Can you squeeze in there? There we go. Let's get down our buddy Tron so he can boost. Let's get down a rat god in the back so he can give us that 54% boost. And let's get down demon mage. That's a pretty good spot for a demon mage right here. Look at this. He covers everyone now. So let's get a 3D view of this room. And see these minotaurs? Don't even stand a chance. A couple bunny bashes and he's gone. Okay, let's fast forward this video until wave 11. Here we are at wave 11 on level 30, right? We're on level 30 of this room and it's it just hasn't even been an issue at all. These bunny bashers are just completely wiping out anything that walks through these doors. It might take them a couple bashes, but since there's six of them, it's, I mean, they're doing 42,000, no, 420,000 essentially damage every time that they smash. See these minotaurs? No issue at all. We do have our rat gods in the back. I placed all five of them and they are fully maxed out. They do have nightmare on them and I did apply all of the additional rat gods to boost so that way we have a 54% boost for these rat gods and we have a 54% boost to all creatures and every hero on this map is a creature. But they are going to be helpful when the bunny boss comes out because these bunny bashers and these whiplash bunnies, they're not going to be able to sustain or even carry just because of the amount of health of this boss. So look at this is chaos bunny number one. Oh, and good. He took the long way. I like that a lot. So we're not going to have an issue beating him, but you can just see how much health that he has and it's not very much damage that these bunny bashers are doing overall. So that's why we need the rat gods. And we should be able to sustain. It's, we're getting closer. We're getting closer. And there we go. Very nice W right there. Get him. Oh, wait. Okay. Whew. That was close. Let's. Uh, we're going to play one more time. And we're going to do floor seven, room five. I'm going to bring the difficulty down. I'm not so sure that we can actually win this one. But let's have a little bit of fun here and see if we can. There's my placements. Let me see if I can upgrade, upgrade. Oh, I should have upgraded in the back. Should have upgraded in the back. We're gonna have to, they only leak 20, so that's fine. They only leak 20. Can we get them? Oh no. Oh, we did get them. Okay, very nice, very nice. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Super fast clicking, and now we can get down our bunny basher. Get them one more time. There we go, yes. We're in a good spot. We only leaked two of them. No, we leaked four, didn't we? No, we leaked three. We leaked three. All right. Anyway, take a look at our bunny basher now. So he's in a really good spot. Let's put a couple more bunny bashers in these locations here, because they are going to be able to reach. Yeah, he's looking. He's looking good now. Really good. Oh no, the shadow. The shadow lord scout. Oh no, we might not be able to. Oh, we did get him. Whew, that was close. Like I said, I don't think this team's going to be able <laughs> to win, but that's fine. Oh, no. Oh, okay, good. Okay, maxed out, maxed out. He's going to, he covers here. I probably should put these bunny bashers right here because of the enemies that are coming out from the backside. These, this last, these last path, these back paths over here. I can place down one more. Let's just put a bunny basher up front. He's gonna be super helpful in getting some money. And you have three you have three paths. So look at this. He completely covers that entire area. One more. There we go. Look at that. He's just he's just covering all of this area. So that's really good. Although I am spacing myself out pretty thin. That's better. Okay, we're at a much better spot now. I like that. I should put these whiplash bunnies towards the front now because they're not going to be able to do anything because of the amount of range. Let's put this whiplash bunny, the amount of range for the bunny basher. Let 
there. I probably even should have put them all in the middle here, but that's fine. I wanted them closer to these entrance ways. And who else do I have left? I need to put down a Bunny Tron to boost. I need to put down a Demon Mage. I can put this Demon Mage right here in the middle because he's going to be able to reach. That looks good. We have our Whiplash Bunnies Max. We have our Bunny Bashers. We have Bunny Tron. Now I need my Rat Gods. And of course, Rat Gods, they're going to have to go in the back. But because their range is so good, oh, they do need to be within the range of Demon Mage. So, how about this? Oh, no. Cla oh, I better hurry up. I better hurry up and put down these Rat Gods. And I do need to boost them. There we go, or I should say level them up. There, that's better. Okay, I was worried there for a second. We're in a much better spot. Just look at all these enemies. They have one million health, but it's not gonna matter so much because of our rat gods and because of these bunny bashers. And the boss is already out. He already spawned. These are the enemies that I'm concerned about, the Colossal Demon King, because they are gonna burn. But can our bunnies get them? Do we have, can we win? This'll be crazy if we can win. Oh no, who burned? Who burned down? Oh, we didn't, no, we're good, we're still good. We're still good. Get this last Colossal Demon King before he, oh no, he stomped! St he stomped us. Okay, just need to be careful. He's gonna stop it, oh no, that's not good. Our heroes are burning, and the Demon Mage is burning. All right, I gotta be careful, these, wait, we're actually okay, we're okay. It's this group right here that I need to be careful of. We might win. We might win. Maybe. Can we? We have our rat gods. Let's put down... Oh, we have. We need a demon mage. Demon mage right here. There we go. There's our demon mage. We might... And he's not going to stop. We could do this. We are going to do it. I didn't think we could do it, and we are. The bunnies carried with rat god. Let's go. That's awesome. Let's go back to the lobby. When these bunnies first came out and I took a look at all of them and their stats in the video, I was like, uh, this is just okay. This is more of a kind of collector's item. But if you're a brand new player and you get a whole team of these bunnies, especially the bunnies that I have, of course you need to get some curses on to get a little bit of lucky with shinies. You technically don't need shinies, but they're actually a decent team. They're not an overpowered team, but they're decent enough. You could see that I beat every single floor with this loadout here. So this is the loadout that I'm going with it's the best loadout I think that I have for the bunnies if you take a look at some of these other bunnies that I have on my team you could even use chaos bunny he's not bad but again you put enough I mean if you want to go two damage and two speed with him and you get minimally infernal on him he actually could be pretty good if you take a look at terror bunny terror bunny is no I, w I, I wouldn't use terror bunny although he throws piercing arrows was that pier yeah piercing knives so that does piercing damage. And then who else do we have? Toxic Bunny is pretty cool. I think he's a lesser version of Night Hair. So if you can get Night Hair, that's probably pretty good. But, but if you have Darkness, Darkness is better. All right, who else do we have? We have Axe Bunny, not overly a fan. But once again, you level him up with two damage, two speed, you're good. Although you technically could do range, but he does teleporting Axe Smash. And as yesterday's video showed, he only attacks one enemy. So I probably would go damage and speed for him rather than range. And then who else do we have? We have Wear Bunny. He's a mythic. And he attacks every four seconds, teleporting Werewolf. I'm not overly impressed with him. Then we have Brave Bunny. Brave Bunny is okay. Nothing crazy, but as I said before, I think with all of these towers, if you can get the loadout that I have, of course, you know, Rat God, you'll have to you have to play around with that. If you don't have a Rat God, then I would put in Chaos Bunny and for Rat God. Try and get try and get five Chaos Bunnies, get Infernal on him, and then you could have swapped those up. But once again, I do have a nightmare on my Rat God then that'd be overly decent. You definitely want Demon Mage for the 72% buff. And then even Bunny Tron, you want to try and get him so he can get that 20% buff. And you want to cash in those urns for Bunny Tron so that way you can level him up to level 5 with all boosts. Because that's going to be really good. So I don't know. I, I, ch I changed my mind about these bunnies that just came out for Easter. They're actually good. They're not great. They're good. 
And anytime you have a team together where you can beat every single room of every single floor, then you can't complain, right? You can't complain. So let's go ahead and clam our playtime gifts here and make sure that you check out my Discord server because I'm running an unbelievable giveaway once trading comes back. Tomorrow ends the giveaway for a, you ready for this? Shiny Containment Clam right there. Shiny Containment, look out for him. So I do appreciate all the comments and all the support. I'm just having fun with this game and I hope you are too. So enjoy the Easter event. We have four days left for the new kings are, that are coming and don't start rumors because I've heard people say that, well, these these tokens here, these king tokens, they're going away. I've heard people say they're staying. We just don't know. So don't start any rumors with that stuff. We don't know what's going on. We haven't heard anything. I'm not going to make any assumptions. All I'm going to say for me personally is that I'm going to try and use these all up by the time the new kings show up. So maybe there'll be a couple more kings over here and we'll get a couple more down here. Maybe there'll be brand new heroes. We just don't know. So. If you can speculate all you want to, just don't tell the community that certain things are going to happen when we do not know, we do not have any insider information for that. But anyway, if you did enjoy this video, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on that notification bell. Thanks again for watching, everyone. Hope you have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!